Never will I let a war cry out in my let those horns cry out in your name this morning. Amen. 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 Church. Good morning, Beulah. This morning we're going to continue on with our devotional service, and we're going to have an abbreviated service this morning because we don't want to keep you real long, but we're going to give God his due. So we're going to have a scripture this morning from Deacon Andre Thomas, and then we'll have a prayer by myself, and then we'll continue on with this service. But it's so glad to see you this morning. Praise God. Amen. Amen, church. Even though we're outside, I'm glad to be in the house of the Lord once Amen. again. Amen. 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 And all these times, let us know that God is still in charge. Amen. Amen. 23rd Psalm says, The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou prepared a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. 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 May this word be a blessing to the hearer, the reader, and the doer of his most precious word. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Our Father and our God, it's just one more opportunity that we have to come and say thank you this morning. Father, we thank you first and always for your son, Jesus, who made our salvation possible. And we thank you always for the Holy Ghost that's leading and guiding us as we go on, Father God. Father, we thank you for a pastor this morning with both wisdom and vision who's overseeing the shepherd, Father God, to keep the sheep as safe as possible. And we thank you, Father God, always for this first family, you see, giving up so much of themselves, Father God, to make sure that this service goes on over, Father God. We thank you always for these Beulah nights this morning. You see, they came to send a message to the devil this morning, Father God, that we won't stop praising your name and we won't stop worshiping you. They came to show him what a great God you are, Father God. You took what the enemy meant for evil and you turned it to good. You've shown us another way that we can serve you, Father God. Another way that we can give your name the honor, glory, and praise. Father God, as I read this morning in 2 Timothy 1 and 7, it said, God has not given us a spirit of fear, but he's given us power and a spirit of love and a sound mind. Father God, we thank you this morning. Thank you for all of us being able to gather just one more time. We thank you, Father God, for lifting us up and so we can praise your holy name. Father God, bless and keep us always. That's our prayer. We continue to give your name all the honor, glory, and praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.